Hi guys, welcome to another video. I hope you're doing well. Uh, when it comes to me, I'm doing okay. Um, but okay is a little bit too much to say. I'm coping. Um, and uh, since uh, I just moved in with my boyfriend to our parents' house, his parents, but you know, my in-laws' house, Mm, I was going through the rooms and uh, I basically moved in into the bathroom um, so you know it's, it's a work in progress but I thought I would show you around um, show you how the bathroom looks like because this is literally the first um, room that has been semi-finished so um, I still want to add a few tweaks of course but you know I'm properly moved in here um, so yeah, I'm going to show you around, uh, show you also my skincare, what's in my shower, all that good stuff and uh, some makeup as well. So if you're interested, then keep on watching and don't forget to subscribe and also follow me on Instagram. Love ya! Okay guys, so this is the bathroom as you walk in. Let me just get in and close the door. <laughs> Okay, so uh, this is the shower. Maybe we can start with the shower. Um, of course, not all of my things have been moved here because first of all, I don't know how long we're going to stay here. And also, you know, I just didn't know if I should keep some stuff um, in that house or bring everything. Anyways, so this is what's in my shower. As you can see, here are my sonic brushes. Yes, I do have two because one used to be used um, by my boyfriend, so uh, I took it all. <laughs> and uh, the shampoo that I'm currently using are from Jackstall, and I really, really like it. The Mask Dream Legs and uh, LV Dream Legs shampoo. Very good range, I must say. Very good one. Better than some Kara Stars um, shampoos and masks. And uh, for my face, I've been using this Pure Clay Clay um, Purity Wash. I know it's very echoey here, guys, and I'm very sorry, but, you know, it's a big bathroom full of stones, so it's hard not to be echoey. And, uh, yeah, now I'm using Dove, and this is actually my favorite body brush. This is from Body Shop. Really, really good one. I love massaging myself with this. And, yeah, here I have just my um, glove. It's a polish brand. Uh, it's like a scrub um, for your body, much better than regular scrubs. And my makeup remover glove, very nice. Yeah, and this is just my loofah. Okay, let's get out of the shower. And here we have the tub that I've never used and probably never will. You know how it is with the tubs, right? <laughs> um, but yeah, uh, what else? Here we have a basket that is initially um, just a laundry basket, but <laughs> since I have no place to put in my hair tools, I just put my hair tools here for now. So I have like my hair brushes here, my straighteners, my colors, my uh, hair dryer, everything about hair tools is here. So this is what I have. And actually it's very easy to reach and I'm pretty surprised of how easy it is to grab. Really, really like it, but I'll probably have to move that because my mother-in-law will surely disapprove. <laughs> uh, but I love her, don't get me wrong. Um, okay, so here is my first um, nightstand, so to speak. Here I have all my skincare that I currently use. Uh, when it comes to skincare, there's so, so much more to move from the other house here. You know, we've been literally moving in the middle of the night in a rush. Uh, so I only grabbed the things that I need on the go and things that were precious. I hope you understand that. I, I think everyone would do that, right? So any bar cups, anything that I'm not currently using uh, was left there. But I'm going to just go and grab it maybe tomorrow. I don't know. We'll see. So yeah. When it comes to my current skincare, as you can see, there's a lot of ordinary products. Uh, here we have also some Sunday Riley. This is the Luna oil, which I love. This is Gran Active Retinoid. Uh, this is my favorite, favorite glycolic acid. This is actually 12% glycolic acid. It's a Polish brand, but I will try to find and link it down for down below for you guys. Uh, here I have some alazaic acid. Um, another, no, this is actually not a retinol. This is a retinol. 
uh, also an active retinoid, and this is 2%, and here I have 12% of vitamin C. And of course, I don't use these products um, in one day, in one go. Uh, I switch between them. Um, so for example, if I'm using the uh, retinoid one night, the other night I will have a break and only use like a nice serum and moisturizer. And then I will uh, go in with, let's say, lactic acid 10%, the third night, if you know what I mean. So yeah, I'm being quite careful, but um, my skin can handle heavy duty products. So yeah, I've been using them interchangeably and here we have my uh, Revita lash um, even though I wear lash extensions I really want to care for my lashes so this is what I've been using uh, all the time to make my lashes grow longer and stronger and better basically <laughs> okay next thing is um, creams so to speak so here I have my favorite origins drink up intensive mask this is my all-time favorite night cream along with the Lano face base, uh, the Aussie Flyer Levo Recovery Mask, uh, which is very good. It's a vitamin cream, very thick, uh, very nice if you want to just recharge your skin after a long flight or if you just need some extra hydration and some extra vitamins. This is what I use for the night or uh, when I use retinol, I will most probably use this as my top up. And uh, here I have, you know, this is my favorite. I use it alone under makeup. Just love it. This is the Laura Mercier Complexion Booster. This is their primer in bronze. And this is just a day cream from Caudalie. And this is the Vinyl Perfect with SPF. Since I use so many acids and so many retinols, I need to remember about SPF. So this is why it's here. And uh, here we have some body products. Again, body products I need to take from the other house. Uh, but here I just have the Nukes lotion, some shea butter from Body Shop, and a nice uh, glitzy, bronzy shrub cream from MAC for the body. But I use it for the face as well, actually. And my toothbrush, nothing interesting. <laughs> Let's move on. Hello. I hope you're well. I'm very casual today, I know. Uh, but I just had a nap, and I just rushed to the bathroom to record for you guys. So let's move on. Okay, so here I have a little stand um, that I have my serums on. Of course, I, I'm going to have to buy my own things like that and the bowls because I just borrowed them from the kitchen. I mean, my, bo my boyfriend brought them for me here. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to have to buy some new ones. And uh, here basically I have my roller. Do I use it? Not really. Um, mainly when I use face oils, I use the roller. Uh, and here I have also the Cuddly Serum for dark spots. My favorite Estee Lauder serum. And this is a very good oil from, from Clarence. And actually I forgot to tell you, the other oil that I have is from Sutana. And this is a turmeric oil. Very, very good one. I love it. Okay. Now, here we have just some face wash from Nux, just in case I'm doing my skincare by the sink, which rarely, rarely happens because I usually do it in the shower, right there. Uh, but yeah, I had just have a soap right in, just in case. Um, and here I have some body oils and one perfume, which is toned for Orchid Soleil, and I only have it here because I think it looks nice. That's it. <laughs> okay, that's the other sink. And this is where I keep my um, face brush cleaning thingy. I don't know how to call it. <laughs> but uh, yeah, just I clean my brushes here, okay? And my sponges. Speaking of sponges, let's put them here for now. I don't have a good space for them just yet. So yeah, let's just keep them here. Whatever. Okay. Uh, here we have my makeup station. Uh, and this is just the makeup that I I am okay with having on display. So here are just my foundations that I'm currently using, like my Huda uh, Beauty Foundations, my NARS Foundations, both of them, my Dior Concealer, Laura Mercier, uh, Too Faced Concealer, very good one, and my Dior Face and Body. And here I have all my lipsticks, so mainly it's MAC uh, and 
KKW and some Mar Jacobs and some Huda, and that's it. Here I have my face powders. I only have two here. Uh, when it comes to loose powders, I really miss my Laura Mercier, uh, but these will do for now. So yeah. Here I have my brushes right above them. So all my brushes and all my eye and lip liners and brow pens are right here in this little cup. So I don't lose anything and they're easy to grab. And right here I have my lip products. Unfortunately, um, there were some lip glosses that I loved um, in my bag that was stolen from the house when we were sleeping. So this is what I'm currently left with. I do have some backups, thankfully. And here I have some small Natasha Denona palettes. I will get into it in another video because I want to do my full makeup collection because this is the only thing that doesn't give me anxiety or trauma to look at because the makeup is the only thing that they didn't steal. So yeah, I can happily do that for you. And here I have my favorite palette from Too Faced. Love, 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 love it. Okay, um, what else? So here we have the uh, cupboards. And for now, I just put all my perfumes in here, guys. I know what you're going to say. This is not a great place to keep your perfumes at. I know. Uh, I will change it up. I'm just, you know, trying to figure out the best place. I had a lovely, lovely place in the beach area house. Mm, lovely wardrobe and uh yeah it's just sad <laughs> but uh but here they're safe you know that's what matters and right below i have something that hasn't been touched yet which is my nail product you know i do my um gel and uh, gel nails on my own they unfortunately stole my nail dryer so i have to wait when i get the new one um but yeah these are all my nail products so they're just gonna be here for now and here i have all my makeup that i will probably have to declutter um i'll do that in another video i hope you will like it and here i have my makeup backups because now i'm i'm that extra okay <laughs> Um, and the other cupboard is actually half empty still, because as I said, most of my skincare I still need to bring from the other house, but I'm just going to give you a sneak peek. I just have a few hair products here, my scrubs, my um, brow setup cup <laughs> with some henna and stuff and tweezers and just some toners and other serums and makeup remover and some creams and that's basically it nothing much in here yet um, so yeah uh, when it comes to makeup i will probably order some nice big acrylic drawers so i can have my products in handy and it looks nice as well so this is how it looks like guys I'm going to give you a nice overview of the bathroom with a nice window. At least I have some daylight and there's a tub, there's the entrance and there's the shower. And uh, yeah, I was really hoping I could do a bathroom tour in the beach house for you. Unfortunately, the beach house bathroom is nearly empty. And I don't know when I will be ready to move back in there. So that's what we're dealing with for now. And my upcoming videos also will be shot in this bathroom. So I hope you are okay with that. Um, I'm planning to do my skincare routine. So I will surely go through all these products with you again. I will show you how I use them, how I peel my face, how I shave my face, everything about my face basically. Um, so yeah, this is what I'm going to do. And I'm also going to film my makeup collection because I know I just briefly went through it. Um, so yeah, we're going to go one by one and I'm going to show you what I have. 
Okay guys, so this is the bathroom that I currently am occupying. Uh, I really hope you enjoyed the video. I know it's, it was very echoey uh, throughout, but you know, it's the bathroom, so it's hard to delete it. But I hope you're okay with it. Uh, please let me know in the comments below if you like those walkthrough videos of mine. Uh, and if you have any other suggestions for the videos for the vlogmas, also let me know. And see you guys in the next video.